Assalamu alaikum everyone, I'm teacher Ahmed and today's lesson is about the past symbol for 8th grade module number 1. So let's get started. Now let's start with the affirmative for Al-Hala al -Muthbata. So we will have subject with the past symbol form. So if the subject is I, we, you, they, or any plural noun, or he, she, it, or any singular noun, so كان الفعل جمع أو مفرد جميعها تأخذ verb to. Then we complete the sentence. Here we have examples. I went to Petra yesterday. I went to Petra yesterday. Another one. He went to Petra yesterday. He went to Petra yesterday. Question form Halit a sual. So we have the auxiliary verb with subject, then the base form. Base form. And it is important. And then base form. Tasrif al awwal So you did with I, we, you, they, or he, she, it. So what can I fail? Mufrad or jamin? Lahtan with the base form. The tasrif, the awwal fail. Then we put the question mark. Idan, fi halit al sual nada al tasrif al awwal. Here we have examples. Did they play? Did they? play at the three fill our huna al tennis last week so the answer is yes or no so yes they did or no they didn't another example did he play did he play so here we ash we put verb one at the three al fail so did he play tennis last week so yes he did or no he did it now let's move to the WH question by using what, where, when, which, who, and how. So here we have the same form did, then subject, then verb one, then the question mark. But at the beginning we add the WH, not the WH, filbidae. So here we have an example. Where did they play tennis yesterday? Where did they play tennis yesterday? So here we need a full sentence. Idan lijaba yajaban tukun jumla kamila. So they played tennis in the curve. They played tennis in the curve. Okay guys, now let's move to the negative four. Halit and nafi. So here we have the subject with the auxiliary verb with not so here we add not with the base for so the subject is plural or singular we don't care so I can alpha jama with did not with did plus not and we can construct it do didn't didn't then here with the base for ma tasrif al awwalil fi'l then we put full stop here we have examples they didn't play tennis yesterday they didn't play tennis yesterday so here we put verb 1 idan fi halit al sual wa fi halit al nafi nada al tasrif al awwal another example he didn't play tennis yesterday he didn't play tennis yesterday. So let's move to the uses al istikhdamat. So we use the past symbol to talk about finished actions and past habits. Then نستخدم الماضي البسيط للتحدث عن الأحداث أو النشاطات التي انتهت. For example. I went to Batra yesterday. إذا أنا ذهبت إلى البتراء مبارح. إذا أنا ذهبت وانتهى هذا العمل. So here we have 
we add ed to the past simple form of regular verbs اذا هنا نضيف ed للشكل الماضي للافعال المنتظمه for example play played cook cooked and the past simple form of irregular verbs والافعال الغير منتظمه لا يوجد لها قاعده so you have to memorize them اذا يجب عليك حفظها for example say said take took okay now let's move to the keywords كلمات الداله so we have yesterday ago in 2019 2010 2000 last week last month last year إذا مع ال yesterday ago in with يعني أي زمن في الماضي. Okay guys now let's move to the exercise. Fill the gaps of these sentences by using the past symbol. إذا أكمل الفراغات لهذه الجمل باستخدام الماضي البسيط. Number one. Ahmed, a letter yesterday. So here we have the keyword is yesterday. إذن هنا لدينا كلمة دالة وهي أمس. And here we have a negative form. هنا لدينا حالة نفي. So Ahmed didn't write a letter yesterday. Number two, I met at this university three years ago. إذن هنا لدينا كلمة دالة وهي ago. And here we have an affirmative form هنا لدينا حالة مثبتة So I studied math at this university three years ago Number three So we do have a question form لدينا حالة سؤال So did they finish So we, we add the base form إذا هنا نضع التصريف الأول للفعل So the answer yes or no so no, they did it. Number four. She, Farah, or MBT, a red car last week. So here we have a keyword last week. And here we have an affirmative form. Hala, Muthbata. So she built a car last week. Number five. Where? So here we have, we get started the question with where. So here we need. The answer is full sentence. And here we have the keyword last year. So where did he work last year? So the answer is he worked at this school. He worked at this school. Okay guys, so you have to write them in your notebook. Thank you for watching. And I will see you very soon. Assalamu alaikum.